One thing I wanted to talk about was a trend in domestic violence. Uh, in terms of the way in which these offenses are being prosecuted, uh, the prosecution service takes these very seriously, as they should. Uh, however, what's happening uh, increasingly is the prosecution service is continuing to prosecute matters where the victim does not want to participate and is not uh, actually present. Uh, it's important that you have a lawyer who understands uh, the ins and outs of hearsay evidence, how the hearsay evidence can be used, and uh, specifically, if someone decides to uh, ignore a warrant, what should the uh, remedy be? Is that equal necessity? Is there a necessity to have that person there, given they had the option and chose not to attend? Or is it uh, something that falls short of necessity, uh, based on the fact that the uh, simply uh, chose not to attend and then the Crown chose not to exercise a material warrant. Uh, this is something that sh should be watched, uh, something that lawyers should be aware of. Uh, you want to make sure uh, when uh, clients are indicating, well, the person won't show up, that's not enough. Uh, and oftentimes the Crown will tell you uh, straight up that that's not enough. So again, this is a discussion on domestic violence and the way prosecutions are proceeding and uh, look forward uh, to hearing your comments.